The Turkish company of Otokar developed an infantry fighting vehicle to meet the potential requirements of the Turkish army and for potential export customers. But other com countries want something like, I would call it a medium tank or a mobile protected firepower system. And that's what we have here. Basically, it is the infantry fighting vehicle platform fitted with a new turret. And that new turret is from the Belgium company of CMI Defence and they've developed a whole family of turrets called the 3000 series. This particular one is a 3105 and the 105 indicates that it's got a 105 gun. What is unusual, it's a 105 gun, rifled, fire standard ammunition and can also fire a laser guided projectile. The turret is just operated by a crew of two, commander and gunner, and that is because there's an automatic bustle loader that carries normally 12 rounds of ready am use ammunition but some customers could really go up to about 16. So that has enabled a very lightweight turret to be fitted and a very compact turret. It is also fitted with a computerized fire control system which enables stationary and moving targets to engage under almost all weather conditions with a high first round hit probability. You also see it's got two, two sites up there. They are both stabilized sites and they have day cameras, thermal images and a laser rangefinder. The laser rangefinder is, is eye safe so you can actually use it in peacetime. A number of countries are looking towards this type of vehicle and the reason is that main battle tanks can, day, can weigh anything up to 60 or 70 tons and that does rather limit their deployment because in many parts of the world bridges can't take them also you can't get them into aircraft so what I call medium tanks or mobile protected firepower with a rate of around 30-35 tons are much in demand.